video explores gravitational waves and the frame dragging effect. In 1916, Einstein published a paper using a linearized approximation of his field equations, modeling small perturbations on flat spacetime and employing retarded potential to predict gravitational waves in close analogy with electromagnetic wave propagation in Maxwell's theory. However, he made an error in interpreting certain solutions, initially concluding that some gravitational waveforms did not transport energy. By 1918, Einstein revisited the problem and published a corrected version. While still using the linearized approach, he amended his earlier mistake and demonstrated that gravitational waves do in fact carry energy. The same year Hans Thiering and Joseph Lenze applied Einstein's linearized framework, specifically the use of perturbations on a flat background and retarded potentials, not to study wave propagation, but to analyze the space-time around rotating masses. In the absence of an exact solution for rotating bodies, the care solution would only come decades later. They adapted Einstein's methods to probe the effects of mass rotation. Their work led to the prediction of the frame dragging effect, in which a rotating mass slightly drags the surrounding spacetime along with it. While Einstein's linearized tools were originally designed to investigate radiative phenomena like gravitational waves, Thiering and Lenze repurposed them to explore stationary fields generated by rotating sources, highlighting both the versality and the limitations of the approximation methods in the absence of full exact solutions beyond the Schwarzschild metric. Thank you for watching this video.